somebody was asking me about confidence before. How do you get confidence? Well, there's there's two levels of confidence, I think. One is from competence. So the more you do something, the more competent you get at it. And so the more you believe you can do it again. So, you know, tying your shoes. You didn't know how to do it when you were young. You were afraid that you weren't, weren't going to get it, you know. And then eventually you got it. And now you don't even think about it. You, you If somebody said, can you tie your shoes? Like, uh, what kind of question? Of course I can tie my shoes. Because you're so competent at it that you don't have to think about it anymore, right? Um, th that's that's a decent level of, of, I mean, that's one type of confidence and it's okay, but it always relies on you having done the thing to then get the level of confidence. Where the confidence that I'm trying to constantly instill in myself is, even if I don't have the answer, even if I don't know how to do the thing, that's competence, I will find the answer. So it's confidence in your ability to figure things out. So if you look at Crystal and, and what she's talking about, you know, she, she might get uh, a vision for what she wants to do and it doesn't make sense, but she's still gonna go off and do it, hopefully. And, and the first step is just one small step of what could be an amazing journey or venture that she goes off on. Um, if she just started her book and she became a best-selling author, that, that idea came from somewhere, right? I mean, the idea to become an author, the idea to write a book came and there was probably some initial self-doubt and insecurities over who am I to write a book and is this the book that I want to write and how do I get it out to the world and all of these things and writing the book is a big deal. But she figured it out. You know? So you don't have to have the whole thing figured out at the start. That That's where most people go wrong because you'll never have it all figured out at the start because you you're, you don't have confidence because you don't have competence. But at the beginning, you don't have competence in anything, right? You're just getting started. How do you expect to have competence in something that you're just getting started on? No, where, you're, where real confidence will come from that allow you to do much bigger things is being confident that you can figure things out. I don't know the answer, but I can find it.